in one day in entire world every government will commit to take the decision against chemical and organic farming they will commit they will commit definitely there is no other way there is no other way there is no alternate the agriculture has no alternate and government has no alternate they have to come here sathiyo in my zero budget nature farming if you have one desi cow local cow indian cow boss indicus belong to jebu family we can cultivate 30 acre of land no single gram of the cow dung manure no single gram of the insecticide no chemical fertilizers no compost no vermi compost no pesticides no insecticide no fungicide no tractor nothing nothing to be purchased from the market that means no chance to emit greenhouse gases no chance no chance no chance at all your production will not reduce i assure you in the first year you will get the production no waiting period no waiting period you will get more production than chemical and organic in first year in the first year and mr jalpati rao has said that non chemical farming it is not possible to non chemical farming none of the farming technology is non chemical farming not at all not at all there is no non chemical farming in the world in the nature every farming technology is a chemical farming wrong statement has been given because the roots of the urea crop are taking all the nutrients in chemical form in chemical form not in organic form not in organic form so non chemical is not existent in the nature don't utilize this type of the world and confuse the farmers the nutrients are existent in the soil in the organic form in the residues of the crop microorganisms are responsible to convert organic into chemical then the chemical form nutrients are available to the roots this is the fundamental science this is natural science not agriculture science agriculture science is not a fundamental science it is not a science it is not a knowledge agriculture science is a big ignorance big ignorance big ignorance in the agriculture ignorance is teaching the student ignorance is teaching sathiyo no single gram of the reduction in the production you will get more production than chemical nowadays and in my technology 10% water is required and 10% electricity is required 90% saving of the water and 90% saving of the electricity that means 90% saving of the emission of the greenhouse gases through thermal power stations even we are giving the project to the farmers to create the energy electricity by means of the gobar gas plant and bullock driven pumps bullock driven pumps to lift the irrigation water from the wells bullock driven no electricity no petrol no diesel no rocket no rocket no rocket we are establishing the models 
on the farm of the farmers. How much maximum quantity of the greenhouse gases we can reduce, we are going to reduce by the zero-budget natural farming mass movement. Satyu, as naturally grown, food is poison free. Poisonless, nutritious and medicinal. Our farmers are getting double prices in the market. Double prices. That means cost of production is zero, zero. Nothing to be purchased from the market. None of the inputs will be purchased from the market at any cost. Cost of production will be zero. So production will be increased, not reduction. Even you will get double ma market rate. There will be no any suicide of the farmer, no suicide of the <laughs> Seven lakh farmers committed suicide in India. Seven lakh. I am not believing the figures of the government. I am not believing. This is my constitutional right not to believe the government figures. None of the example is existed. In seven lakh farmers committed suicide. That, that farmer committed suicide who is practicing zero budget natural farming. No single example. That means we have proved if you want to stop the suicide of farmer, there is one solution, zero budget natural farming. One solution only, one solution. Honorable Agric Agriculture Minister of Telangana, Manyasri Srinivas Reddiji, he listened my workshop in Hyderabad city two times. He visited the models in Telangana. He called me, I want to visit the model in Maharashtra, please give the addresses. I have given the addresses and with 250 papas, he came into Maharashtra, he visited our miracle model farmers of sugarcane and all the other in Maharashtra. He was totally surprised. He reacted, it is a miracle, it is a miracle. But not taken decision yet. Why? <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Print and electronic media personality should ask this question to him. This is the responsibility of the media personality. They know. Even I have discussed Honorable Agriculture Minister of Indian Government, Mr. Radha Mohanji. He agreed. He read my books. Not taken decision. Why? I don't know. I don't know. So, we are not dependent on the government decision. Not possible also to depend on the government decision. We will not wait for the decision of the government. We will continue our movement, mass movement. Because we do not want anything from the government. When there is a meeting with the government, my first sentence is that we do not want single rupee from your government. We do not want single rupee from your government. Because we do not take any funds from anybody. 25 days in a month, I travel throughout the world to liberate my seminars. I do not take single rupee as a honorarium. I do not take single rupee as a honorarium. Because this is the mass movement, it is not a business, it is not a business. 
So we are not dependent on the government decision. Let them to take decision in the future or not to take the decision. When entire farmers will commit suicide in the Telangana, they will take decision later on. Maybe. We will not wait. Wait for them. But that is responsibility of you person to stop the destruction of the natural resources. That is the responsibility of you people. Telangana people. And how we can stop the destruction, I think that it is the time now to discuss on this platform. Now there are statements are given by the variable state governments and government of India also. Ah, we are doing something for stopping the suicide of the farmer and we will give 5 lakh rupees to the family where the farmer is suicide. That means government has given the decision, a message to the farmers. If you want 5 lakh, you suicide. <laughs> Don't care, we will give 5 lakh. Kya chal raha hai Hindustan mein? Kya chal raha hai? Kaisa soch rahi hai sarkar? And eh, every farmer is known very well. He can't get 5 lakh rupees in his entire life. Because there is a losses in the agriculture by means of the chemical and organic. Organic more dangerous than chemical, more exploiter, more poisonous than chemical. Organic people unconsciously, it is not possible to get 5 lakhs. And if they are getting 5 lakhs, and farmer has no money to marry child, the girl, lot of money they want for the marriage. And when he is uh, uh, listening that 5 lakh rupees will be we will give the 5 lakh rupee to the families. He take the decision, oh, I have to suicide so that the marriage of the, my girl will be done by the government. They are giving the wrong messages. Governments are giving the wrong messages to the people. You suicide, we will give 5 lakh rupees. Don't care. We have to protest this decision. We have to protest this decision. Satyu, and other claims are done by the governments that there is no irrigation facilities, so farmers are committing suicide. And they have, this issue has become very serious now in the entire India, in the government decisions. I ask one question to the governments, maybe state government, maybe government of India. Punjab is having 98% irrigation facilities. Why Punjabi farmers are committing suicide? This is a question we have to ask the government. Even there is a big agitation now in Karnataka against the suicide of the farmer in Mandya district, there is a huge quantity of the irrigation water they are getting. The farmers, sugar cane growers are committing suicide who are getting huge quantity of the irrigation water also. Why? That means they are not going to causes of the suicide. They are not going to actual causes of the suicide. They are searching in the mass, in the moon, in the space. They are diverting the your mind towards the, away from the suicide, away from the causes of the suicide. This is the conspiracy. Some governments has claimed, no, 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 no. Farmers are enter in the psychological depression. So we have to give the 
psychological treatment to the farmers. Master government, master government. That means the farmer will go announce in the media, oh, I am going to suicide, please come and give the meditation. meditation. What is going on in India? They are diverting the focus away from the causes of the suicide. Away. Deliberately, deliberately, deliberately. I have studied well the real causes of the suicide. And I found five to six main causes are responsible for the suicide of the farmers. Number one, continuous increasing of the loans of the banks and money lenders. Because he is committed to take the loans continuously, increasing loans from the banks and money lenders because the cost of production of every crop is continuously going up by means of the chemical and organic farming also. Even the cost of the organic farming inputs is four times more than the cost of the chemical inputs. That means organic farming is more costly than the chemical farming. You go to the market, investigate, you will see. When you take the loan from the banks, every year the rate of the inputs is increased continually. That means you have to take the increasing loans from the banks and money lenders every year. And now you have taken the loan, you have grown the crop, and crop is uh, come on the, at the harvest stage and there is a hail storm. Otherwise, a yeah, huge rain, high rainfall, no rainfall, no rainfall, hail storm, severe cold or hot waves. Otherwise, bacterial infection, fungus infection and insect, is, insect uh, attack and entire crop is spoiled. You have taken lakhs of the loan, crop is totally destroyed, and then government will come. Okay, 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 we are, we are. Achha, you are? Don't care, don't care. Give me 10% of the loan, we will give again 100% loan. Is it correct? Loan conversion, name is given loan conversion. That means 100% loan, next year again 100, 200% loan. And again, next year also there is a natural calamity, destroy the crop. Again government will come, don't care, we are, we are. And again 100% loan, loan is increased, it is not possible to refund the loan. And then banks will, recovery officer will come with the weapons to recover the loan. Kurki, Japti, kya bolti isko? Huh? In Tilgu? Huh? Huh, just to... And they will sell your property. TV, pants, all the materials will come out the house. And morally, totally upset, morally, Farmer become totally upset. He can't give the eyesight with the another people. And he totally destroyed the morality. Ultimately, he come in the decision to take the 50 milliliter endosulfan and to go away from the earth. Moksha prapti, moksha prapti. Agriculture university has to get the Nobel Prize, Nobel Prize, to give the moksha prapti to the farmers. What is called in Telugu moksha prapti? Ah. Agriculture University ko Nobel Prize dena chahiye ki kisano ko unho ne moksha prapti ka marga dikhaya. Moksha prapti ka marga. 
and they are giving the speeches and supporting the Green Revolution on the dais. Satyu, in zero budget natural, natural farming, nothing to be purchased from the market. Cost of production is zero. That means if you will not purchase anything from the market, cost of production is zero, no problem at all to take the loans from the banks and money lenders. Not necessary, not necessary. Our farmers will not take single zombie loan from the money lender and banks. That means this cause is totally neutralized automatically if farmer will start zero budget natural farming. Second cause is natural calamities. This natural calamity destroyed the entire crop, entire crop, every year. But we have seen the miracle. We have seen the miracle. In Andhra Pradesh, there was two big cyclones. In Vishakapattanam, Kakinada, uh, East Godavari, West Godavari to uh, Srikakulam, there is a severe cyclone. And now, Tamil Nadu and southern part of the Andhra Pradesh, severe cyclone. Entire crop of chemical farming was totally destroyed. But we have seen the miracle. There was no damage to the naturally grown, zero budget natural farming crops. No damage. <laughs> Our rice crop was fallen down, no doubt. But after cyclone, it come up again and stood. <laughs> and giving the message, don't care, don't care, don't care. I am with you. Vijaya, you go to Vishakapattanam, there's a miracle seen by the all farmers. That entire uh, mango trees were destroyed by the cyclone, but her zero budget natural mangoes were alive. alive. Everybody has seen. I have gone, I have visited now. I have visited in this month. I have seen the miracle. Heavy rainfall and in cyclone also, we have shown that zero budget natural farming crops are alive, they are not damaging, we have shown. We have upload, uploaded the videos in the YouTube, you can download and you can observe the reality. In this year, in Marathwada of Maharashtra, some part of the western Maharashtra and some part of the Vidarbha also, there was a drought condition. Continuous two months, there was no single drop of the rain, no rain at all, it's continuous two months. Continuous three years, there is a drought condition, Maharashtra. And we have seen the miracle. Neighbor's chemical soybean was dried, Chemically grown cotton was dried. Chemically grown sugar cane was dried. Chemically grown pomegranate was and mosambi was dried. But zero budget natural soybean was allowed full granary with parts. Our pomegranate was full green with uncountable fruits. Our sugar cane was green with the big, beautiful production also. Our vegetables was alive, no damage at all, but that is totally dried. Why? There is no water there, there is no water, there is no rain, there is no rain, that crop is totally dried, our crop was alive. Why? We have shown in severe natural calamities like drought also, Keval, only zero budget natural farmers can survive. No chemical farmer will survive. We have shown it. You can come tomorrow 
Keshwara Vahegaokar is there, he will give the details. Satyu? Only remedy to stop the destruction of the natural resources and to solve the problems. What are the challenges created by the, the system, exploited system in the world? Only solution, I think, the Jiru Natural Fund. In the cold also, there is no damage to our crop, but chemically grown crop is damaged. In dark condition, why there is no damage of the uh, naturally grown crop? Why? Why our crop are alive? Why they are destroyed? Because we are not utilizing the water from the wells in Jirubhari natural farming. We are not utilizing the water from the canals in Jirubhari natural farming. We are utilizing maximum water from the atmosphere in zero budget natural farming. Because atmosphere is the ocean of the water. In rainy season, there is a more than 90% relative humidity in the atmosphere. That means if there is a 100 liter of the year, you will get 90 liter of the water in the form of the vapor. In winter, 65 percent relative humidity, that means 60 percent, 60 liter of the water in the form of the vapor. And even in the summer, also 35 percent water vapor is existed in the atmosphere. Atmosphere is the ocean of the water, and we are utilizing that water in zero budget natural farm. Humus is the main absorber of the atmospheric moisture and straw mulching, that means mulching material is the main source of the absorption of the atmospheric water. One kg humus absorbs six liter water from the atmosphere in one day and give a level to the roots of the crop. In night, maximum quantity of the atmospheric moisture is absorbed by the mulching and mulching is giving the moisture to the crops. Since three years, severe drought in South India, your farm fruit trees are totally dried, but on the bund of your farm, the full granary has been, you will see on the huge tree of the tamarind mango. Why? Your crop are dried, your orchard is dried. Why the forest trees are not dried in the sewer dot? Why they are full granary with full granary and production? Why? Agriculture industry have no solution, have no answer at all. Have no answer. I have the answer. Because in the drought also, maximum water is taken from the atmosphere, not from the wells, not from the canals. In the eight day workshop, all these things are verified, very broad. broad. Not possible within two days. So Satyu, Second cause of the suicide of the farmer, we have neutralized natural calamities, we have neutralized. Third cause is market, market system is the third cause for the suicide of the farmer. When the crop is going to harvest, the prices of the agriculture produce is declined deliberately, deliberately. And farmers are not getting the benefits of the prices. Ultimately, they are committing suicide. Zero budget natural farming produce is poisonless, nutritious and medicinal. We are getting double prices, double prices because nobody is willing to die with the cancer. 
Nobody is willing to die with the heart attack. Nobody die, is willing to die with the diabetes. Everybody is willing to survive. And they know by means of the media awareness. These harmful diseases, deathful diseases are committed by only poisonous food. And these poisons are given by the agricultural university technology. That means chemically grown food and organically grown food by means of the cadmium, arsenic, mercury, lead, heavy metals. They want poisonless food. They are willing to give the higher prices because nobody is want, wanting to die with the cancer. And by means of the CISPE commission, the huge quantity of the money is introduced in the pockets deliberately. So purchasing power is high. And so we are getting double prices. That means cost of production is zero. Production will not decrease, production will be increased. And there is a huge demand in the market for the poison this food. Double prices, no single example will be happened in India that farmer will commit a suicide. No single. We have neutralized the cause immediately, the market system. We are going straight to the consumer without any mediator system. We have to link the farmers to the consumer, state producer to the consumer. Mediator system, we have to close, stop immediately. I will give you an example. You are selling the tomato in the APMC, that means market, agricultural market, producing market. You will get 2 rupees per kg. The hawker purchased 2 and half rupees from the that mediator. And he is selling 12 rupees per kg in high society. These 10 rupees are not coming in the pocket of the farmer. 10 rupees going to power in the pocket of the mediator system. But if you sell the tomato to the state to the consumer door on 10 rupees, the consumer will be benefited by 2 rupees and you will be benefited by 8 rupees. This is the link we have to develop. And when you will get higher prices by means of the, this linkage to the producer the consumer, immediately there will be no cause to commit suicide, no impact of the market system, no impact at all, no impact at all. We are selling our rice 70 rupees, 80 rupees per kg. We are selling heat, wheat 40 rupees per kg. We are selling our jaggery, bellum, 100 rupees per kg. We are selling every commodity, every input, uh, output of the Jehovah natural farming at higher rate because, because there is a great demand. So we have neutralized entire, we have neutralized the market system. We are totally neutralized. 100 farmers group will be attached to one housing society in Hyderabad, will tie up, he will, uh, the farmers will grow, naturally grown, produces and milk, they will go to the, use the door delivery to the consumers and they will, prices will be fixed by the farmers, not by the government, not by the uh, market, and entire money will come in the pocket of the farmers to fix the prices of the agricultural produce it is not the right of the farm, uh, uh, government, it is not the right of the um, uh, market, it is the right of the farmer, it is the right of the constitutional right of the farmer. And we will follow that system. So this cause is totally neutralized. And fourth cause of the farmer suicide is government decision. What is the miracle decision has taken? When our agricultural produce is coming to the market, immediately government take decision, stop export and start import. The prices are fallen deliberately. It is happened, it is happened, it is happened. But we have neutralized this 
issue also, this cause also. Because in entire world, globalization means, globalization means to produce the product on minimum cost of production with high quality, you can capture entire global market. The global consumers are willing to give the high prices to poisonless food, high prices. Zero budget natural farming, cost of producing zero, with the nutrition and medicine value, we can sell in the global market on low prices and we can capture entire global market if the government of India will think about this process. That means government decision also is neutralized by our movement. We will sell straight to consumer, we are not dependent on the government decision. So, we have given the solution, what are the problems are created by the system, there is no solution to the agricultural universities, no solution by NGOs, no solution the government, we have given the solution. How to adapt this solution, this is the problem and we will discuss thoroughly within these two days. I think that zero budget natural farming we will discuss definitely. How to practice zero budget natural farming, what is zero budget natural farming, no doubt. But again, we have to give the assurance, assurance to the next generation for their survival. So it is very essential to adopt a natural way of life. What is to be done for that purpose? What will be our role to save the nature and natural resources? How we can continue our business and our services, but we can do for services, best services to the society. We will discuss within two days. Mm -hmm.